player and, and uh, helped me tremendously. So, I mean, obviously when you go back and reflect on the, the last three years, you're really going to remember uh, all, all the stuff that they've helped me with and, and, and all, all the games and all the times that we've had. But, uh, I mean, I, I couldn't be any happier with the decision I made out of high school. Um, it, it was the best three years of my life playing here, and uh, I'm, just, I'm just grateful for it. Yeah, you, know, just the, you were a guy that came in with so many, so many expectations and you know, were a key part of this team from day one. Mm -hmm. How do you think just the way you've developed and the player you've become um, is can you reflect on that development at all? Oh man, I mean, it, 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 it's <laughs> night. It, yeah, it, it's night and day. Uh, I mean, coming in here at high school, I, I was just just raw, and uh, they 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 saw potential in me, and uh, they got the best out of it. And uh, I, I I bought into what they were, what they were saying, and uh, it was just one of those where, where I'm just I'm just grateful for what they did. I mean, they, they saw the potential in there, and uh, uh, I'm glad somebody did, and, and it, it worked out well. And and obviously with every everything that happens, I mean. You always want to win the last game of the year, and it's disappointing that only one team can. Mike, uh, Sully kind of said in there, you guys kind of set a new standard for the program. Mm -hmm. but, I mean, is that kind of how you look at it, too? I, I hope so. I mean, I, I hope that uh, his first few recu uh, recruiting classes did that, did what he wanted. Uh, I mean, obviously, we, we didn't win the national championship or, or anything like that, but I hope we laid the groundwork for, for what he wants to have uh, in years to come. When Hudson did lead the game, I mean, how, what was the kind of mentality during the dugout? Just, Oh, I mean, I mean, for, first you're hoping for his well-being, just just hoping everything's okay, and then uh, I mean, we knew we had plenty of pen with, with Crawford and uh, and Larson and Maddox, and uh, we had Paco back there, so I mean, we, we we were confident. It was just one of those where we knew that they would have to throw up a couple of zeros for us, and uh, we just had to battle the plate. You guys have talked so much about the expectations, and you know, kind of all the rankings, but how much did you guys think about that and have the expectation of doing better than this? Oh, I mean, it, we really didn't think about it much, honestly, and. Uh, I mean, you go back and you look at it, I mean, anything can happen in baseball. I mean, we played games and we played great, and we played games and we played bad. So, I mean, it's one of those where we took it one game at a time this season and just just happened to be fell up short. Coming off the runner-up finish last year, then, what were the team expectations? I mean, I obviously wanted to make it as far as we could. And, uh, I mean, we, we tried to go out and play our best baseball, but uh, we made a few mistakes and uh, did, didn't score runners when we needed to and uh, didn't make pitches when we needed to. But, I mean... It's one of those, that's how it works. I mean, it's, it's extremely disappointing. Three. First, did you recognize the problem right, right away, or when did you detect something? Um, a, a few batters in, he looked like he, he was having trouble catching his breath, and uh, I went out there and talked to him, asked if he was okay, and he said, he said yeah, and I gave him, I said, I'm going to stay here just so you can catch your breath. And uh, a couple pitches later, he, you could tell he was having a little bit of difficulty, and uh, Sully, Sully went out and was able to make that call and have the trainer come out. So it's just one of those things that uh, I just uh, hopefully he's fine. And you probably were hoping with rehydration that it probably would have been good enough to at least make a shot at it. Yeah, you, you hope, but I mean, it, it, it's one of those where it's, it's his well-being first. And uh, I mean, but like Sully said in there, he, he, he saw it in his eyes, and uh, it, was, it was his call, Sully's call to, to make the decision. I didn't think it was the wrong one by any means. But uh, you just hope he's all right. Three straight trips to Omaha. Not a whole lot, lot of guys get to do that. How would you sum up these last three years? Oh, man, unbelievable. I mean, best years of my life, experience stuff through baseball that I never got to experience. And uh, it's just one of those where, I mean, just, just great for the University of Florida. I mean, um, if, if they didn't see something in me to, to come here, then I, then I wouldn't have been able to make it. But uh, it's one of those where, where it's disappointing that we didn't get to where we wanted to. But uh, in, in the end, we sort of did. Right. Thanks a lot, Mike. Yeah, thank you. Keep going.